thing with SLA is that they can miss actually the feeling, the emotion, um, the experience of the customer. Um, whereas the XLA, I think that's its main focus. It's looking at the customer experience. And um, although that can sometimes be a lot less tangible and a lot mm. less hard to measure than an SLA because you're not dealing with, you know, X number of time or minutes spent or um, uptime, that sort of thing. It's much more of a feeling and emotion. Um, it can be harder to work with. I definitely see that with customers. Uh, but it's so much more important, I think, to look at that experience side so that you don't end up with the watermelon effect and you've yeah. got like a much more holistic view of, of yeah. the service as a whole. And and I, I saw from your article, that you, you kind of put it the same way that, that we do, that because humans are not, you know, binary, they are not computers. So they do feel, they do feel how, how it was. And there's always this saying that you kind of never remember what, what happened, but you remember how you felt about yes. it. So, so that's why I, we also feel that it's, that's really the, the key 